I'm back two days early before Star Wars Galaxy's Edge premiere. I'm really excited about this. I mean, I'm not so much excited about the whole Star Wars thing, but I'm excited about being one of the last groups in before the press and media gets to get their grungy little hands on the place and give their opinions. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to give my opinions. Hopefully they, Disney has everything all set up and working properly for us and doesn't wait just until the press gets there. I'm worried that they may do that. Anyway, welcome everybody to another... It, this is kind of like a, a Nomadic Monday, just not on a Nomadic Monday. This here is Nomadic Tuesday, maybe? I don't know. I just got home and I figured, what the heck, let's check what's in the mailbox from you guys and uh, do some quick little unboxings. So kind of like Nomadic Monday where I normally read off the comments within the videos. Today, I got a f one package and an envelope from you guys. So I figured why not open it in the same vein as a Nomadic Monday. This is not gonna be a regular type video like that. It's gonna be a one taker, a one take video. But other than that, this is not going to replace Nomadic Monday. I'm just here a day early. Really can't get out, shoot a lot of video just yet. I still have to deliver this load in the morning before I head over to Thousand Trails. So, I figured I'd put this together. Anyway, I'm not going to need scissors for this. For this little thing here. So, this comes from the Duo Finds. Now you can check out their videos. They have a they have a, actually a pretty incredible channel. The Duo Finds most uh, most of the time they're hitting like antique stores, picking up some pretty great stuff. Huge horror fans. They live up in the Chicago area, and they sometimes in between work, you know, they work a lot of hours and stay you know and stay working kind of like I do. And then when they build up enough time and enough money, they go on an adventure. And one of their previous adventures was a couple filming locations, Walking Dead filming locations and uh, Stranger Things filming locations. Definitely a channel to check out. And I know what is in here because they contacted me, I believe on Instagram, and, and asked if I wanted this. So they specifically made Look at that postcard they made. Isn't that freaking amazing? And that's their channel right there, the Duo Finds. They made that. They asked me if I wanted one. I said, yeah, heck yeah. So they are, I mean, you can check out their videos. They're great. Really, they're, they're really good uh, on uh, YouTube. And also they have Instagram and I believe a Facebook. So you can check them out there. And I think I felt more stuff in the envelope. I was just expecting their amazing little postcard. Oh, yeah. Oh, they gave me another one. I got another one. Look at that. You know what? I may send this out to one of my Patreon supporters. I may just randomly pick a Patreon supporter and put this in an envelope instead of putting a stamp on it. Or I could put a stamp on it and mail it off from Walt Disney World during Star Wars Galaxy's Edge because Disney does have they, they do have mailboxes there's more stuff in here what the heck guys what the, the duo they, they sent me some stickers the duo find stickers look at that and their sign off slogan which I have not created one yet I suck at it I suck, suck at coming up with slogans and another sticker here well, thank you guys. Thanks, Matt. You guys are freaking amazing. Look at this. Look at all this. No cat. The cat wants the stickers. She's not going to get them. Put all this stuff back in here. 
and get you another box that when you this is a box that that, that was an envelope but would you look at that massive thing here this is really heavy this comes from Tom Salter in Adamsville Alabama Reverend Tommy he has a YouTube channel also um, what else does Reverend Tom do uh, he creates hot sauces and that's what I like about his videos so when I'm watching his videos I like it when they do the crazy hot sauce tasting stuff and he and every time peppers are in season he creates hot sauce so I'm I'm expecting some hot sauce in here possibly man you really definitely take this oh almost got myself on that one you definitely take this one up forever let's see what he got in here I mix okay should have probably cut it just a little bit better I'm thinking it's hot sauces but it's an Amazon box did you order me something from Amazon okay wow there's a ton of stuff in here oh no, there's a bunch of little wrap stuff and something extremely heavy another box we'll see what's in there okay so let's see what's in here I'm assuming this is one of Reverend Tommy's homemade hot sauces I'm kind of excited about this Look at that and that's what it is Take it out of this little thingy here so you guys can get a good look at it i'm pretty sure he sells it you might have to go to uh his youtube channel oh would you look at that redemption sauce he is a reverend so I, the title makes sense it would make sense if it was a bob marley sauce too right it's a verde sauce with jalapeno kick ingredients jalapeno chilies tomatellos whatever that is roasted garlic roasted onion distilled white vinegar water pink something sea salt black peppercorn and spices I'm gonna I'm gonna carry this around with me a lot of the truck stops foods they uh, they, they really don't have no flavor and that, oh and I think that might give some of the food the kick that it needs so here's another box that was in there this this one's pretty heavy What's, where's the scissors at I need to give me an unboxing knife dun, dun, dun. so what we have ooh, what is all what is all this looks like a pump of some kind it's lights look at that that's some serious LED lighting right there. There's another one in here too. Oh, yeah. Look at that. You that's wow, Reverend. Thank you. This that is massive. So I guess you have to tie it into a battery or something because there's a positive and negative. I, w I wonder I wonder how you juice these things up. This. There is instructions. He was kind enough to also send some instructions. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty insane. Thank you so much. These things are heavy. They're all metal. Look at that, guys. Is that some awesome? That's some awesomeness right there. I wonder how you. Uh, once I get, you know what, I'm going to have to hook all these up and uh, figure out how to even turn them on. If you could change the the modes and the colors. Let's take this one off of here too. Because there's no buttons or switches on these, so i, I got to figure out how to do it. But look at that. Definitely some nice lights for video. Nice. I, I don't even know what to say. That's pretty amazing. And kind of scary it's something i have to assemble I'm, I'm a little nervous about that but yeah well thanks guys um yeah i this was not i did not expect 
this, something like this, that's, that's pretty cool. So let's look at the brochure here and I'll tell you the company of those lights before I end today's video. Yeah, look at that. This is not going to be easy. Um, factory real shot. Uh, okay, about us. We are one of the leading manufacturers and suppliers of vehicle LED lights, vehicle accessories. So this is more for vehicles. So that's why this would mount onto the front of the RV. I thought they were camera lights. So I mount these on underneath the RV. Wow, that's really cool. Uh, by adopting Philips LED core lights. Let's see here. It's a light bar. We have professional research development team provided by blah, 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 LED light works, LED driving lights, LED light bar. What's the name of the company? I don't, I don't know what the name of the company is guys. It doesn't say. It says you can contact customer service, but it doesn't say the name of the company. Hmm. Oh well. That's that. I would like to give them a shout out, but I don't know the name of the company. But wow. Yeah, they're pretty amazing. I wonder if the company's on here. It's not. There's a slide here with screws or nuts for probably mounting and stuff. Okay, now this makes sense because I was wondering, how are you going to mount this up for camera lighting? Which I bet you could. I bet you, especially in the motorhome, I could hook into the wiring of these lights up here and, and have it down instead of putting them on the front. I could have different LED lighting. And juicies right off the battery like you would if I was driving down the road. Wow. I, I'll figure something out with those. And wow. I I appreciate it. These, these are really amazing. Thank you so much. Anyway, guys, that's about it. I'm going to go ahead and uh, kick back. Maybe go do a quick load of laundry so I don't have to do so much tomorrow. As I'm heading over to Thousand Trails. And uh, yeah. Thanks, everybody. Uh, that, that that was that's really special and thank you duo finds thank you to the duo finds for the that the stickers and the and the amazing postcards and i'll see you guys on the next one hopefully from disney's star wars galaxy edge or thousand trails or harry potter it's going to be from somewhere all right guys i love you all i really do I'm, my mind is blown peace out everybody